Everyone has an S's experience. Here's mine by Daryl and Hudson. I met Coy Murray officially while working a short time in the sponsorship department at Essence Magazine, which was both a tremendous opportunity and one of the worst burnt out feelings that I've ever had in my career. Being on contract to work in the Essence offices from sunup to sundown, being chauffeured back and forth to the Essence office and being flown back and forth to New Orleans with a group of women who were my peers and my idols was something that I thought I always wanted. It was the extension of a sisterhood that I grossly wanted to be a part of. Corey was introduced to me by Rachel Hill, who walks me around the offices and made me shake hands with everyone. She was my supervisor in the sponsorship department. Since I had pitched to Corey as a freelance writer for many years, um, through so many forms of communication, I couldn't believe that she remembered my name, and when I shook her hand, I blushed. Many, many meetings and deliverables and exhaustive conversations later, I was let go of that fabulous position. Not because of my work ethic or a commitment to the Essence brand, but because Corey spotted me at the BET Awards that year, working with what was a dear friend of mine, Tasha Wittengren, in a collaborative environment that I actually loved while I worked at BET. Yes, I worked for the BET Awards and Essence Music Festival at the, at the same time. Let's talk about burnout. After that experience, I never pitched to Corey again. A few years later, we'd meet and she'd walk me around the one floor that Essence had at the, in the time building at the time, and we took pictures in front of a mural, and I wondered if she ever remembered ratting me out. Years later, um, I pitched to, to Julie and landed two back-to-back -back articles on their website about black stylists that I love who were working on hot TV shows at the time. It would be meeting, uh, had to have to meet with Julie at a Macy's uh, diversity panel in order to get paid for those two articles, which was really almost a year late. I love Corey Murray. And I love what she represents. I love the hard work and ethics that she put into this brand. And I will miss her at Essence, but let me say this loud and clear. I am so excited about what her future holds because I know that it's bright and I wish her the best.